Top of the time zone, everybody. This is Freddie J here with Freddie J Sports, and we are back with another season of the TGC Tours. We're in Challenge Circuit K here playing the Cracked Open at Fishing Lake Golf Club. Appreciate y'all for coming by. We're about to start our first two rounds uh, here to see if we can make the cut. If y'all like this kind of content, make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, hopefully, when we finish round two, we will make the cut so we can move on to round three and four. If that's the case, we will be live on this channel and on Twitter at Freddie J Sports with that coverage. So, without further ado, let's go ahead and get underway. It's been a minute since we've played uh, PGA Tour 2K23. A lot of things have happened. Uh, last time I tried playing, I was just not happy with uh, the results. Uh, just not happy with the courses that they had at the end. Uh, it was very... Um, it just seemed completely difficult for uh, reasons that I was just like, no matter what I did doing the practice rounds, and I think I actually, uh, I'll admit, I was not happy with, uh, like, I, I pretty much withdrew from the round, one of the rounds, because it was just like, it, like, no matter what I did, it would just roll off the green, and, uh, and this one is going to be in the water. This wasn't the first time this happened. It happened uh, in our practice rounds too. That first shot just goes into the water despite how the wind and everything. And apparently that one's going in the water. Well, we might have that one hang on. But we're looking at a, bur a bogey right now. Gonna go ahead and punch this one with a nine iron and uh hopefully we get some uh movement on it. Oh no. Already a terrible start for the season, so we need just need to go ahead and get this one for at least double at this point and go from there. Cause uh this is not good. Swing's a bit consistent, and man, we might look at triple already. Oh, hold on. All right. One putt to clean that up. Was not expecting that. We we're going to get a replay real quick. One thing we've been working on is trying to line up these putts, especially this is 24 feet out. The, the breaking on that one was very sketchy, but we were fortunate enough there to be able to sink it and really, really just proud of ourselves there. Not proud of the tee shot that led to where we were, but We still got a ways to go. Two over to start the round. Here we are at the second. It's a par five, so we can probably make up a couple uh, strokes here. Maybe get a birdie. This is 538 with a 30-foot incline. That's a perfect. Three hundred and four yards there. With a three hybrid in hand, will this be the club to save us? Gonna go with the three wood, shorten it a little bit. And that one is going nowhere towards the green. It's gonna be on the fairway, but we could have been putting for... We could have been putting for Eagle here. But as you know, that's not the case. Gonna go with the chipping wedge here. Uh, 
I'm hoping for a little bit of a turn, but that thing is not turning. That slope did not move. Nothing really moved on that. We was just a little bit too fast there. And now this putt is 17 feet. Not a lot of movement here going left to right, but do want to be careful as the green speeds are pretty fast. That one's already starting to the right. This is not going to make it. We'll get the par. Disappointing finish there, but it could have been worse. We just don't want to make pars on par fives. And now here we are at the third. There's no par three here. Right after the par uh, fives. And that's normally the case, but not this time. Uh, this one's 490 yards. Going downhill 14 feet. We got some uh, headwind, so hitting our face not really cool but uh expect a lack of yardage here and again too fast and this is going to be short too i'll be surprised if this gets up to 250 but that's going to be deep rough in 240 that's going to make us think hard about what we do in this next shot this one honestly we might just have to lay up here We're just not hitting the ball well. Prime opportunity to get on the green. I mean, on the next shot, but we, we couldn't even get on the fairway on the second. So this one's going to be a scrambling par. Our tempo is just bad right now. That's not even... Yeah, we're going to be looking at another bogey immediately. And that is not going to be fun. That is not fun. And we're going to have to look at this slide and just be like, hey, look. We just got to do what we can here. So far, the leaders, my goodness, through two, are currently 20 under. I'm starting to consider whether or not I should have even played. The cut line is three under. I'm not comfortable with that cut line whatsoever. Looks like we're going to have a bogey here. We barely got that one, dude. That was almost looking like it was going to fly a little bit uh, to the left there. That would have drove me nuts. Currently three over for the day through three. Well, we're at the fourth, and here's our par three that we were looking for. Now, based on what we've seen from the last two, the last three holes, we, we really need something to happen here to help us out. Because otherwise, we're looking like a bag of potatoes. We're not going anywhere. And once again, another fastball. You thought we were playing the show. No, we're not. Another green and regulation missed because of a bad swing. There we go. That's going to fly a little bit, but 14 feet shouldn't be too bad of a stroke. That's a good line. Knocks it in. We'll save par that time.
No birdies on the scorecard yet. But it's only through four. We have plenty of time. Not really trying to rush this, but... I'm really desperate for a comeback right now. Because that leaderboard... It's horrendous. There we go. Finally got a good drive. This is going to be for at least 250. Definitely 280, probably. I don't think it's going to roll down the hill. 284. Not bad. This is also a par 5. Uh, normally, I would try to attack it, but with our distance here, I feel like it's just safe to lay up. As long as you lay up right. Oh, the wind is not moving it much. But it's still going to be on the fairway. Might get a good roll here. That's probably one of the smartest plays we can get. It's a safe play. We have no choice here but to use a the pitch with the lob wedge. It's not too bad. I think this will work with us. Nice stoppage right there. This is now for birdie. Good read. Finally. Took us uh, five holes, but we finally got it. Now can this give us momentum as we go on to the sixth? This one was a tough one. We've got a dog leg to the left here. Trees in your way. I try to cut around these trees, but nine times out of ten, that's not likely. And not hitting the best ball here. Oh, man. That's going to be a weird look, but I think we have a clear view. Actually, I'm going to go with something different here. Three iron punch. Well, I saw the vision, but unfortunately, it didn't give us quite the result we need. Going with a chip here. That one carried a lot. I don't think this is coming back down. It tried, but that hill was not budging. This is 8 feet for par. Going right to left. Good recovery. 13 minutes in. Currently 2 over through 6. And now we're at the seventh here, par four. Yeah, the, the, we played from uh, closer, but unfortunately, uh, we don't have the chance to risk it. This green from the from the shorter tees is drivable, but unfortunately, we're not in the those tees so we have to go for a little bit back so that was i mean we're not in the water so that's good but uh wish it could be a lot closer I'm gonna go for five iron here because i do not wish to be short that's a perfect let's see if that gets there that looks like it might get there that looks like it might get there. 
That is looking very good. You could stop now, though. Amazing shot right there. Now we have a chance for another birdie. It's a little bit right to left, though. Let's see if this is the read. It's turning well. And we got it. All right. Big time birdie right there. Brings us back to one over. We took a bad tee shot. Great recovery. Amazing read on the putt. And now we're on par three with a little bit of confidence with us. That's a bit slow, but I think that's going to be safely on. I don't know if this is going to kick out far, but yeah, that's going to carry some distance. We were just trying to be safe at that point because we know if we left that short, that was going to roll off, and I don't want to deal with that. You don't want to deal with that. This is going to be our longest putt of the day for 42 feet. think this is tracking well. Oh, my goodness. Oh, wow. That is... Listen, it can't get any better than that. That was superbly done. If it was a little bit slower, it would probably fell down, but... Beggars can't be choosers. That one was pretty close. Now we're at the ninth. Currently one over. Oh, that's a nice sound right there. That one's definitely got 250 in the bag. 280. We're going to get a 300-yard drive here. Give this one a 316. But we're on a slope, so you can expect this one to come off a little bit to the right. Going with the 7-iron here. I don't know if the wind's going to be an actual factor. But we was right with it turning to the right. Didn't put a lot of forward momentum on it, but it stayed put. Playing safe is honestly a good strategy when... You're new to the course, but we practiced this offline a couple of times. We failed to make par often on the course. But when it comes tournament time, we just got to do our best. This is 27 feet. That's looking good. I like it. We made it. Yes. Wow. Wow beautiful shot and we're gonna get a replay right there look at this twenty seven feet I believe that is now our new longest putt of the day I also want to let y'all know y'all might hear me quiet right now because I'm recording this at 10 11 o'clock at night it's currently quiet hours. We're just trying to get this thing going. I want to be as enthusiastic as possible, but I know this game would like to tempt me to rage, so I'm going to try to just be chill as possible tonight. But if we make the cut, you'll get some live coverage this Thursday. But uh, not if we uh, keep hitting tee shots like that. Yeah, that's going to be a tough one to get out of. We just lost so many yards. We This is a par four, mind you. I I, I personally don't think that's a, the right move right here. If we're, gonna, if we're not going to make the green, why risk it? Let 
like I did not know how that was going to come up. So honestly, good call. Good call there. I think that is not a bad shot, but I wasn't expecting it to land straight. But we do get a little bit of a turn there, so we can probably score this for par. There's not a lot of movement here. 12 feet. Left, right to left again. We're getting a lot of left turn putts. Oh! That was cruel and unusual. And looks like we'll start the back nine with a bogey. He was actually at even par when we ended off. But we're going to just shake that off. We're not going to think about it. What we are going to think about is how we're going to attack this next hole. Going with a three iron. That's going to be a little bit... Oh, yeah, that's way off to the right. We wasn't expecting that. It's on the green, but... Putting this one's going to be a tough challenge. 43 feet. This is now the longest putt of the day. And this one got some speed to it. Getting it close will be a reward in itself. see if it has some breaks it did not it almost rolled off to keep it a buck with you all right now this is 17 feet we need to clean this up that's gonna be close just by a hair that doesn't make it Disappointing. Two over. All right. Now we're at the 12th. And we're picking up speed with our driver. We definitely don't need that. It's 277. Personally, thinking about risk it at all in this one. That's probably a good swing. Let's see if you can uh, check this one right down. Oh, no, that's right at the hole. That's going to get some. If it went below the hole, I think it would have been a lot closer. If it, But it was parallel to it. This is finally a left to right turner now. But there's no Timmy over here. So we're just going to have to wish. We can get a birdie. I don't like the speed. That's frustrating. 15 feet for par. Man. Three bogeys in a row. That's definitely frustrating, but we're going to increase our vocabulary here and go well we can't necessarily go for it but i'm gonna try to put this one as close as i can 338 yards the cup par four and that one sounded deadly got 314 out of that Got a lob wedge in hand, 50 yards. 
to the hole now. That one is going to not even get close. I should have known it was going to try something like that. There goes our birdie. And here comes our par. Finally a par to end the bogey streak. Now let's get a birdie streak going before the course ends for the round. We're already at 25 minutes in. We're going to be having to pick up the pace here. This one's a par 5, 564 yards. That sounded great. We're definitely going to be on the fairway. For 322, 200 and something yards left. We do have... Hmm. Now, we do have a bit of a problem. We got these trees in the way. However, can we bend our shots to get through it? That was a bit fast. And it went straight to the trees. Couldn't get enough power through it. We probably could have made it had... We actually put more on it. We're going to get the lob wedge out right now. And we're going to try to make this thing work. stop what a stop right there six feet can't blow this there we go what a perfect time to spark up back to two over with now at the 15th That should be just fine. It caught a lot of the air, though, so that's one thing I don't like. But we're on the green. This is going to be 40 feet from the pin. Yeah, almost 50, actually. Here goes nothing. I think that's going to be a little bit shy. Oh my goodness. Pulling no punches there. That was a good putt. No tears on that shot. I am content with what happened. Now here we are at the 16th, our last par 5. This is going to make or break. And this one decides to... What a shot. Let's admit it, that was pure luck right there. We are eternally grateful for that. However, I don't think this is the safe play. This is no way safe. In fact, I'm just going to be smart. We're not going to make it. We, we got a bone there. That was honestly a good call. Can't afford to, you know, let that one go to waste.
116 yards to put it on the green. That's going to be the best we got right there. It's going to be a little bit wide to the left, but I think it's going to stay in distance. Seventeen feet for birdie. Uh, so close that really hurts. It would have fell in. It just needed an inch. That just hurts. Like the false advertisement on these breaks would drive you nuts. All right. So we won't finish under par here unless we ace this one. It's not too bad. We might hope for a hop skip and kick to the left, but... Not quite. It was trying, though. That should set us up nicely. Eight feet. All right. Well, we could have been one over had we at least saved par. Now for the final hole. Round one. Hundred and twenty seven yards with a lot of bunkers in front of us. And that's a perfect. Granted, it still moved to the right. It's gonna be a long putt. But we've made long putts. This isn't even our longest. Twenty five feet with not a lot of movement. It's all about how you hit it. That one's looking good. It's not going to slow down, though. That's going to roll off. Well, that's been happening a lot at this final hole. Man. The struggle continues. Okay, now what's going on here? We're going to walk off this course with a double bogey to finish it. Truly disgusted about that, but we have our work cut out for us. We had we saw the potential here. Look at it. We got one, two, three, four, five birdies. A lot of these doubles and triples we could have avoided. But it's going to be a whole nother game here. That's going to conclude this round's action here at the Lower Fishing Lake Golf Club. 
appreciate y'all for coming by, and as always, I'm Freddy J. Y'all have a good day, and a better tomorrow. Until next time, we'll see you.